This is the case board. Track your case on it. You got enough to pin this on someone else? Push that button and give me a call. It would have been nice if they had focused on any other suspects. There's no card in here. I need to find the password. Maybe it's somewhere around here. Snacks. Oh, Hannah, you always know how to cheer me up. Mmm. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. calling to say you lost the evidence locker key? Oh, that's some great police work there, rookie. I'd better listen in. Where'd you see it last? Pancake City? I don't recall Pancake City being part of your beat. Go find that key. I should send someone to Pancake City to find that key. Is there a lot of crime in Pancake City? Well, it's good to know you're keeping the mean streets of Pancake City free from crime. No, it doesn't make me less angry to hear you're embarrassed. Go find that key. Flip Pancake City over if you have to, but find that key. You did not just ask me if that was a pun. Do I make puns when I'm angry? No. When I'm angry, I ask rhetorical questions and fire rookie detectives. George, it's Nancy. Nancy, what's going on? How are you? All right, for now. I'm not going to be able to get out of here until I can prove that I'm not the one who set the fire. We'll do anything you need to help get you out. I found the police investigation board. Perfect. It looks like we're on the right track so far. They've narrowed everything down to just a few suspects. Who do they suspect? Tony from over at Scoop, Alexi from the Antique Store, Brenda Carlton, and Deirdre. And, of course, me. Good. We'll keep an eye on all of them. That includes you. I've got my eye on you, Drew. Thanks. And you ain't got nothing on me, cause I'm innocent, see? I need your help finding a key. Alright, what's the story? I need to get into the evidence locker. Detective Ryan lost his key. I need one of you guys to find it. Sure thing. Any idea where we should look? Yes. Try checking out Pancake City. You got it. Your turn to take over. George, reporting for duty. Detective Ryan, I think you said he was going to Mabel Rose's? Detective Ryan, I think he went to the antique shop.
Greetings. Are you the Alexi from the old stories around here? That was a long time ago. I can't believe that's actually you. You were the original kid detective. You should advertise that, put it on your sign or something. That's not who I am now. But it's something to be proud of. Just let it go. It's my past, not yours. Did you hear about the fire? Of course. What do you know about the old town hall fire? No more than anyone else. Have you seen Detective Ryan? The 12-year-old cop? Yeah, he's been here. He, he left something behind. Did he leave it behind to torment me? Possibly not. Is it tormenting me? Yes, yes it is. Can't figure the blasted thing out. It's on the new arrival shelf. See you later. Bye. Detective Ryan brought in something pretty strange. There's a key under there. I won! I bet this is what Nancy was looking for. How's the investigation coming? All right. It looks like I'm going to be able to use some of the equipment around here. If I don't get caught, that is. I don't understand why they won't just let you out. Since all of the evidence is stacked against me, they want a little proof that I didn't do it. Still, it doesn't seem fair. Trust me, I'm with you on that one. What was it like being in the fire? Were you scared? Absolutely. It just spread so quickly. Whoever set that fire knew what they were doing. From everything we've been hearing, you're lucky to be alive. Until we catch the arsonist, the station might actually be the safest place for me. It's your turn. Nancy Drew, taking over. Better find a way to listen to this. All right, my phone. Better see what evidence the police have. They seized gasoline. I need to find out what was really used to start the fire. Looks like the alarm wasn't working at the time of the fire. I need to find out why. Got it.
Did that. Check. That's done. Did that. That's done. Did that. Check.